So I wanted to check in with you guys. Today is Tuesday, July the 4th, 2023. And um, thank God for Facebook giving me a reminder that it was four years ago right now that I was in this very spot in Bangkok, Thailand, uh, starting round one of my journey through stem cells in the recovery from my traumatic brain injury and so I didn't know it was July 4th today I actually got up early uh, joined up with a meetup group at a local park nearby for a long run and one of the guys said oh you're an American today is July the 4th and I thought oh wow indeed it is so <laughs> I have done my five mile run in honor of July the 4th Independence Day in the US of A. I'm grateful, I'm blessed, and I'm really blessed that four years ago, this very week, I embarked upon a journey of unknown uh, outcomes and consequences in my quest to rehabilitate and recover from uh, the traumatic brain injury I had suffered working in Cambodia. So um, I am remarkably grateful for the journey that it has been. Uh, greatly up, greatly down, plenty of times smooth road in the middle. But it's funny to think that four years ago, I couldn't, I wasn't running. Um, I struggled doing more than three to five push-ups at a time. Cognitively, I was just not home. Um, and it was that gap of high level cognition and ability to live out a highly functional life that I was pursuing that I wanted to believe was still available for me that uh, led me fortunately by the grace of God and a wonderful uh, supporter of mine to consider the stem cell journey and thus here I am four years later not only um, doing better but did a five mile run early this morning. Uh, my brain is doing great in the midst of uh, heat, humidity, um, and other environmental factors that way back when, years ago, were really crushing me. So um, I love the opportunity, the, the new opportunity given to me to explore and try and attempt and discover things that my body and my brain are giving me back. Like uh, I want to embark upon a journey of ultra fitness events just to discover what do, what do I have inside of me? Who am I? Um, things that were not even on the table four years ago. And so for this Fourth of July, I am remarkably grateful for the people who were in my life and have come into my life to nurture and rekindle a zeal for life far greater than the path that I was on before, but this new path is just uh, worlds above what I believed was possible for my life. Um, not just from the head injury, but also just from really not living a life um, full of discipline and structure and belief that the ambition I had was, was possible. Um, I uh, have circumvented some of those faulty mindsets that uh, those limiting beliefs trying to tell me that um, I'm tapped out, I'm maxed out, 
this pursuit is for somebody else. Uh, I don't have the capacity or equipping, and it's just nonsense. We all have the capacity to develop the equipping for whatever we set as those targets of life. So uh, I'm grateful to be sitting in front of this camera four years later. Um, it's been a wonderful batch of life these four years. Uh, I'm eager for these next four years because these will be tremendous years of discovery, of, of ambition, of pursuit of a future self that I not only just hoped was available, but will be taking steps day by day to bring that to fruition. So I believe everything is possible. Um, and I don't want to be that impediment to great things, great endeavors, great impact, um, discovering how to live a life of significance and positive impact. So happy 4th of July. Um, for all those out there wondering is recovery possible? Whatever is ailing you, if you've got breath, then use that breath for gratitude, um, to create a, a mindset that there is still beautiful life to be lived, no matter what roadblocks, hurdles, speed bumps uh, are seemingly in front of you. So take heart, take hope, have a great day.